What up you guys, it's Raymond. We're over here at Scooter Zone right now and today's video is actually about a quick little product review on a, a new part from Envy that a lot of you guys have probably been seeing online on Instagram and uh, probably on TikTok and things like that. Uh, but we have the all new Will Scott Premium Hand Grips from Envy. Now these things were actually really, really cool. As soon as I heard that Will was getting a signature part, I was actually very excited for him because getting a signature part is something that you'll never forget. It's something that's very special. It's a huge accomplishment and I uh, really quickly just wanna say a, a huge shout out and a congratulations to my boy Will. Good for you bro, I'm proud of you. And uh, these things look absolutely amazing. We got five different colors here as you can see. We've got the clear, we got the teal and purple kind of swirl color. We got the black and teal. We've got straight up black, of course, you have to have that, it's a classic color. And we had this new color that's this lime green and teal, which I think is really cool. Um, and the cool thing about all of these grips is they are a little bit thicker. And uh, as compared to something like a vital grip or a TPR grip, uh, which is a, a very a much smaller grip. It's still the same. It's it's still a long grip. The TPRs and the vitals, as are these. These are 170 millimeters in length and seven millimeters thick. You get you have all of your uh, your details and things like that on the back of the grip, which is really cool. Uh, I think one of my favorite things about this grip is probably the fact that they come standard with metal bar ends. Now these aren't like a normal metal bar end that a lot of you guys have probably seen Envy make before, like their expandable bar end that you actually tighten in there. Uh, these grips uh, come with these bar ends and these are actually press in uh, metal bar ends, which I think is really cool. Uh, it's something that's different. Nobody's ever seen that before in the scooter world. And um, I, I am actually uh, really appreciative of things like that that are kind of new. And uh, these bar ends also have like a very uh, detailed kind of graphic on them, which again, super tasteful and things like that. Of course, with different grips, you have different bar end colors. All of them have that standard black inner color, which I think is cool, because it means that it's gonna match everything. And uh, you have the teal right here. The teal and black grip has the teal kind of colored metal part of the bar end, the actual al aluminum, I almost said alloy. The aluminum on the actual bar end is anodized, which is cool. We also have the oil slick version on the purple and uh, teal colorway, which I think matches really well. I, I don't think that oil slick really would have looked good on anything else, but I also don't think that a normal purple would have looked nearly as good as the oil slick does. So you got the clear with the chrome or raw or polished, whatever you want to refer to that as, that colorway. Again, a perfect match. And uh, we also have, of course, the normal black, which has the black anodized metal part of the bar end. And you have the green and teal colorway that has also a black, which I think was probably a good move. I don't think you could really anodize anything that would look that good. I don't think green would have looked that good. Maybe the teal, teal would have been a good move, but obviously teal looks a lot better with teal, so um, good move there. Also, I wanna point something out about these bar ends, which I think is really, really interesting because again, it's something I've never seen in the scooter world, but it is very, very cool. I'm just gonna show you guys on these grips right here. So you have two different styles of bar ends, right? You have the, the normal plastic and you have the ones on the top, which seem to be just an aluminum bar end. And on the back, you can you notice that the bottom bar ends, the ones that don't have the aluminum around them, that is sized for a chromoly bar. So this back end of this bar end is a little bit bigger, and the ones on the top are sized for an aluminum bar, so they're a little bit smaller. Um, and a lot of people are probably thinking, like, damn, I, I can't run the aluminum bar ends on my chromoly bars. Uh, it's actually really interesting. So if you push up on this bar end, like on the actual plastic part, and you take this whole thing out. This metal piece actually comes apart. Whoa, shot that a little far. So the actual metal ring comes apart from the bar end. So these are interchangeable metal bar ends. So if I take out this larger sized chromoly bar end, or chromoly size bar end, I should say, this thing will just slide right in there. It pushes in, it's got like a tight, nice little fit in there, but once you actually push this section of your bar end into your bar, it'll hold that thing still. And uh, I think it's really, really neat that uh, Envy did that. Like, I think it's just a in very interesting way of going about a metal bar end. It's a press-in metal bar end, uh, interchangeable extremely easily, and things like that. But it's it's just really interesting, because again, it's something I've never seen before, 
And um, I'm really stoked that Envy is kind of going that route and kind of favoring everyone that has uh, a chromoly bar or an aluminum bar. I think it's a really cool idea. So I want to talk about the actual design of the grip, what you're actually holding on to. First of all, the grip is extremely soft. So for those of you guys that are always worried about, oh, I don't want my grips to be hard, that's kind of a thing of the past, and these definitely don't differ from that. Extremely soft, so you're gonna get that gushy feel, of course. Again, like I said earlier, these grips are a little bit thicker, so for those of you guys that like to run thicker grips, this is a great option for you. Uh, and the actual design on there, you have a couple different heights of what I like to refer to as ribs. Um, you have kind of this Envy style, uh, like diamond design here, right? Um, you've probably seen this on uh, some of the prodigies and things like that. And basically, what this is, is kind of like the strength factor. And it, and it kind of goes throughout the grip here, which is really nice. So that means that it's not going to separate, it's not going to wear down on one side and kind of give you this weird feel later on. This is going to be uniform throughout the entire grip. One thing that I've realized a lot of people that buy grips kind of look out for is this small taper on the top end of the grips. This definitely has that taper. It's not anything extreme. It's very slight. It is not a smoothed out taper, but I personally like that. I like the fact that it's kind of a, an immediate uh, angle as opposed to it kind of flowing into that. So it's an interesting feel there. I, I always hang my um, kind of my index finger over my grip when I'm doing some tricks. And the fact that this isn't like a huge end like it is on the on the what's supposed to be your bar end of your grip, the fact that that's not what this is on this side is really nice. It's really comfortable, and uh, you guys have probably done tricks to where you've landed and you've landed with your your hand kind of covering the inner side of the grip and possibly touching the actual handlebar. Um, if you do that with something that's super large like this, it's just gonna be a very odd feel and you have the chance of kind of screwing up and possibly falling. So um, that thing I think is really neat and uh, I, I like that idea. Underneath the ribs that I was talking about earlier, you have just a, a traditional rib style that kind of just goes around the grip, just small circles, whatever you wanna refer to it as. Um, and that has proven to be a very effective design when it comes to grips because one, it keeps the integrity of the grip alive. It makes it very strong. I know when I'm t talking about the strength of grips, it probably doesn't make sense to a lot of you guys, but you guys have seen grips just absolutely fall apart in some instances. That kind of keeps a grip from doing that. Plus the fact that it doesn't gather sweat really fast is always really nice. Now, I haven't actually ridden these grips yet. I want to clarify that. I have not ridden these at the skate park yet, so I'm kind of just giving uh, just a, a looking review and kind of reviewing the grips as to what I can see as a rider and professional rider of 15 plus years now and what I've kind of experienced. Uh, also, I want to point out the packaging on these is very, very nice. That's one thing that as a business owner, I'm always looking at because I want to be able to hang these grips in my store for everybody to see. So Envy made that super easy for me as a business owner. Um, obviously, we just have our normal hanging thing. It's probably something not a lot of you guys don't really care about, but um, I do. And uh, they also took the time to really focus on uh, the, the graphic on the front end of this packaging. Uh, it's got Will's name right up here on the top. Obviously, it says premium hand grips. You got your Envy logos and uh, Will Scott's signature at the bottom with this kind of, what it's kind of like a KOS sole sort of design on there. Um, speaking of the KOS, all of these grips are gonna come complete standard on the new KOS scooters. So the KOS scooters will come with all of these grips. You'll have your metal bar ends in here. You'll have all of these different colors, the clear. You have uh, obviously just all of these colors are gonna look really, really good on the new KOSs. So I think that was a really cool move for Envy to do. And I think it's gonna really be cool for Will to see his grips so often on scooters that are uh, going to you guys that are riding them. But I want to say a huge thanks to Envy on behalf of Will for giving Will a signature part. Um, huge congratulations to Will. Will, you designed these amazingly. I'm really, really proud of you, bro. And uh, if anybody deserves a new signature part, it's you. Uh, if you guys want to grab these grips, they will be available here at Scooter Zone or at www.thescooterzone.com along with any scooter parts that you guys need. Check us out. Um, they're not quite available yet for us to purchase. 
But as soon as they are, we'll make sure to get a ton of these in every single color. So if you guys want to ride them, they will be available very, very soon. We'll be posting all about it in all of our social media platforms as well as on my personal ones when we actually grab these. But uh, yeah, these things turned out amazing. Really, really stoked for everybody involved. And uh, I want to throw some on my scoop ASAP and get an actual riding review for you guys as soon as I can, which will be in the next video. But um, as for this video, thank you guys so much for watching. Hopefully you guys enjoyed um, the review of the all new Will Scott Premium Hand Grips from Envy. And uh, appreciate you guys watching. And until next time, I'm out of here. Later.